When you ride a Brompton, normally you feel a little bit out of place, a little bit odd, because everybody else is riding around on normal wheel bikes. But here, it's a little bit like a sort of Elvis convention. You're surrounded by other slightly off-piste people, all on their Brompton, so you suddenly feel totally normal riding around your Brompton, <laughs> looking a little bit bizarre. But that's half the fun. Very intrigued by the World Championships. Uh, a friend rode it a couple of years ago and sold it to me, so I'm uh, very glad to come along and take part. And that any sport that allows you to buy your way to the, to the front of the grid in a World Championship has got to have something for it. I'm a world-class athlete now. <laughs> I use this bike almost daily. I have to tell you, I replace this bike of my uh, two cars. I have a Porsche and a Ferrari. I spend more time on the bike. It's fun for us. We don't win, but it's fun. And I, I think the English people, they are wonderful to do something like that. Tell me where it hurts in your body. Uh, everywhere. <laughs> Mine of the chest, I'm getting too old for this. I enjoyed it, but I'm not very fit this year. So I reckon well down on two years ago, but still fun. <laughs> well, they start us off on a real rough part of the course. Very hilly right off the bat. And then the back, uh, the back is nice and long and get some good coasting in there and uh, can enjoy the scenery just a little bit until you get the long hill up until the final here finish. <sighs> Great atmosphere, just fantastic, just to come here and enjoy, enjoy the spirit of the event. It's typically English, isn't it? Just wonderful. Oh, that's a tough course. This is a crazy event, crazy event. I'm not aware of anything like it. I'm aware of one or two other folding bike races, um, but there's nothing on the scale of this. It's sort of 750 people in, in the grounds of Glenlin. I mean, really, what could be better? Mm -hmm. 